somewhere along the line we're going to discover we've been had if we haven't already figured it out I want to show you how the planet Saturn the Saturnalian Brotherhood the worship of the planet Saturn <clears throat> Saturn's color was black the black uh, all each one of the gods and each one of the planets were associated with a different color green was associated with Venus and that's why today in Islamic countries today you will see all of their flags and halotry in, in Islamic world are in green and you'll see the crescent with the star many people think the crescent is the crescent of the moon but it is not according to the actual uh, research documents <coughs> The crescent on the Islamic flags is the crescent of the planet Venus and the star represents Venus it is a religion that is based on the worship of Venus but which has incorporated the Saturnalian philosophy in it so like all the other religions it is also a very eclectic religion <coughs> Uh, but suffice it to say that the planet Saturn is very important and you need to remember that and do some research on it and you will find that the Nazis were the Nazi party was probably the most glorious Saturnalian brotherhood we've ever seen Nazis were heavy into the Saturnalian system of philosophy war destruction the ancient Phoenician Canaanites said that the women should listen to their god Saturn they always knew Saturn had rings so they said the women should listen to their gods so women were women were to wear ear rings men were to get married before their god so they were to wear a wedding ring kings were to get uh, crowned before their god so consequently they would have a round crown the corona the ring Saturn is the god of this world from that we get the dark side of the force Darth Vader remember Darth Vader with his Nazi helmet speaking through the Masonic triangle somebody better do their homework this stuff is fascinating when you get into it <clears throat>